Welcome back to Bioshock Infinite. In the last episode, we found her. We ha we went through a couple universes, and honestly, I don't know what really happened. I'm still kind of confused. I just burnt my tongue on some coffee, so I might be talking a bit funny. I have no idea. But besides that, now we... It looks like this might be a big fight coming up, so I thought Can you this would be this? cool. It's a simple dual dial lock. My book said most fools keep the combination no more than 20 feet away. Well, let's hope we find one of those fools. Ah, oh, crap. Does that mean I gotta find a code? That means I gotta go find a combination. This might be it. Why are you so keen on lock picking and code breaking? If you put a person in a cage, they develop an interest in such things. I suppose so. I Zero, four, five, one. I knew those statues would be dangerous. The bird! It's the bird! He's come back for me! Or her. What's up? You are loud! Did he leave? Elizabeth. Well, I know the code, at least. I had memorized it. Oh. Is she gonna do it? Elizabeth, you promise me. I will stop him. No. That is an oath you cannot keep. But promise me that if it comes to it, you will not let him take me back. Oh, you want me to kill you? It won't come to that. That's messed right. up. I have a duty to bring you somewhere, so I have to do it. I don't plan on killing anyone except for Comstock. Go to Comstock's house. Where is it? You okay? Look, Boxer was tearing his place apart. And somehow they became our enemy, even though we were supposed to help them. But no. Everyone wants to be my enemy, because that's how it's supposed to. Do it. Okay. Oh wait, that's completely useless. Let's do this. Oh crap. Oh crap. Don't shoot me, don't shoot me, don't shoot me. Heal. I'm gonna die. You missed me, miss me. Ah, no. I'm gonna so die. Booker salts. I don't need okay, salt. Yes. I okay, thank you. I needed a health pack. Not salt. Decoy! Shoot him! <gasps> Medkits! Wait, I need this! Go ahead. Alright! What the? Who's shooting me? All right, we're gonna swing by you real quick. Nope. 
That's not what I meant to do. I died. It became an all out fist fight. Are you serious? There we go. Oh, crap. Thank you. Yeah, it really was. I'm a lot of powers. I am currently dying at the moment. Thank you. You're my ally now, right? Oh, he, he's gonna kill me. Running, I'm stuck. Thank you. Got a lock needs picking. Back there at the shop, what you asked me to do. Let's not discuss it. No, what did that thing do to you? If he were to take me back, that's death, Mr. DeWitt. There's something so like it, I cannot tell the difference. Well, that's understandable if you don't want to go back, but I'm not here to kill you. That is not my job. My job is to get you out of here, which is completely different. What is this? This is new. My hands. Oh no, they're melting. I'm fine. Return to sender. Oh. Press to generate a magnetic shield. Hold to absorb damage and release to throw it back. Hold and release to create an explosive trap. And it took away my water powers. Damn you. I I was using those. Booker, I don't want the possession. I still have the damn possession powers and I hate it. I hate that I still have it. I never remember to switch it. Watch out, sniper. Where? Oh. You're bleeding. Look, here. 
Much obliged! That's all I've got. Oh wow, those sniper I didn't realize how bad the sniper damage was. Oh, that explains why they gave me this power. So if I get attacked. I am going everywhere. What is... Oh, that's my bomb that I placed, apparently. Oh, shoot. Where did he see me? <laughs> Don't die. I have died twice already. You dragged me all the way... Oh, sniper rifles. Elizabeth. Done. I didn't think there was going to be a sniper war. Where you at? Boom. Are you kidding me? Okay, I'm dumb. I admit it. I am dumb. You know what? Let's just keep the damn sniper rifle for now. Come on, show your face. Can't find anything. Now that I know I can just have any power I want again, I feel a lot less stupid. Looks like we're about to have an all-out battle over here. That gate lies Comstock House. Might as well go then. Lady Comstock, how lovely to see you. Wonderful of you to make the journey, especially considering your painful death 19 years ago. Huh. Lady Comstock. Well, that's yes. interesting. The thing has mistaken me for my mother. Apparently you died. Your fingerprints do not seem to be your own today, Lady Comstock. Are you unwell? This isn't going to work. I think it can. Your mother's dead, Elizabeth. Yeah, that's yes. a big factor in whether or not we can get through. Let's head to where she's buried. 
Are we gonna steal her hand? Is that what we're, we're gonna do? Are we gonna steal her hand? Let me drink my coffee real quick. Okay, now I'm ready. Thanks for the money. Two people with the same name, L Ludus. That's a weird name, Porter. Thanks for the hot dog. It's time to go grave robbing. It's your mother's grave. They have her preserved in an airtight chamber. Her fingerprints will get us into Comstock House. Let's She's chop the off her hand. Child doesn't draw a lot of sympathy in my book. Take a moment to think about what you're doing. There. Will you open the door or do I have to go in without you? Let's chop off her hand. Eh, you're in my way. How are you, mother? All locked up in there, huh? You don't even look the same. Let me do it. No. Let me do it. Let me cut off her hand. Well, that's not good. Oh, no. What is happening? He was the one that recommended this. What I do, I do for love. What are you doing to her? Oh. Oh, whoa. Whoa, what's happening? Did she escape? Elizabeth, are you all right? Where, where did she go? Hold on, you need to rest for. We just saw a no, ghost. I'm getting that hand. Elizabeth, why is your mother a ghost? She's not. He, he used me to, to power that device. He opened up some kind of tear. Your mom's a ghost. He's raising legit zombies. Yes. Thank you. No scope in time. Call of Duty montage time. Let's do this. Boom. Where you at, ghost? 1v1 me. I have to reload. You're lucky I have to reload. Well, I just shot the guy. Ooh, ooh. I am dying. I am dying. I am dying. I am dying. We are gonna die.
Damn! Thank you for the health pack. Very much did need that. Whoa, that's a lot more dead guys. Open it. On it. Is this a golden shotgun? Yeah, it is. Die, ghost. Is she dead? I think she is. What is she? I don't know. What am I? My God. Is she the oh crap! Power? But what is when the she heck did they get here? Or dead? Why do you ask what? When the delicious question is when. The only difference between past and present is semantics. You look like her mother. We'll live. Dies, died, will die. If we could perceive time, these were you guys. What reason would grammar professors have to get out of bed? Like us all, Lady Comstock exists across time. She's both alive and dead. She perceives being both. She finds this condition disagreeable. Perception without comprehension is a dangerous combination. Look, this is very confusing. Footsteps. She goes to unfinished business. We have to follow her, convince her to open the gate to Comstock House. I need ammo. It's a shame you have need of her to enter Comstock House. Frankly, she doesn't seem all that cooperative. There is a way to bring her to reason. Three truths you must discover first. Truths which, in this world, Comstock has destroyed. If only one of you had the power to alter time and space. That would be a blessing, wouldn't it? Mm. Well, we just happen to have one person that can. Well, they're sarcastic. There's something off about Lady Comstock. Yeah. I notice. No, you don't understand. She, she doesn't belong. She has her own footprints. I'm just, I'm not so sure it was her. So we brought in a demon, you say? I gotta go kill a demon instead of a ghost. I don't think I signed up for this. I have no idea where he had gone. I think he's stuck somewhere. So forget about him. <laughs> Hard to do anything if you're stuck, sir. What did this place have to do with my mother? Probably a lot. Oh, that was weird. I didn't like that. I've already used these. Found some money. Okay. Thank you for the coin. On to the next area, I guess. Come on, poke your face out. Point blank range, dude. You went point blank range into a sniper rifle. Timing. They won't be 
Collateral. Oh, never mind. Come on. Headshot. Where did you come from? There's my machine gun. This one's mine. Fifty percent. What's that? Fifty percent of everything people earn here goes right to Comstock as a top. I gotta get me a job in the profit business. It's a tear. Reek of deception. Where'd he go? Just disappeared after I shoot him? Ooh, here's the tear we need to do. And if I do this, this uh, sabotage, all their patents, all of them, Mr. Fink. Now, why does the Prophet want these two killed? For the same reason Lady Comstock lies buried. Child. And why does he want me to do it? Because only you can make it seem an accident. <laughs> What did you mean before when you said Lady Comstock didn't belong here? She's almost feral. It's like she's a reflection. Um, I don't know. Yet Lady Comstock produces no child. I have done what a man can do, yet there is no child. I've asked Lutessa about the matter, but even she refuses to help. If she couldn't get a child, then how was she born? Lutez says the bastard is a creation not of her womb, but of some unholy science. I do not know which is true. The child is no more divine than I. What says that from my husband's prophecy? He begs my silence, but I can only offer him forgiveness. But with repentance, need come truth. I can suffer his lies no longer. So she isn't her kid. The safe just opened by itself. There's just a ghost standing in the middle. Damn ghost. For bringing people back to life. Woo. It's hard to bring more people back to life if I keep burning them. Or blowing their brains out. Thanks for the ammo. Really appreciate it.
I'm gonna die! Now we have to find the next tear. Oh, she takes up a lot of ammo. Yes, please. Yep, we gotta go in here. I'll give it a whirl. It's done. Okay, we have found the fine the uh, hopefully the final tear. I took your funeral photo. Yes, I made an absolute hash of it. One doesn't expect a picture of one's cause. To come across so lifelessly. I don't think that's the real Lady Comstock. I think she's. I think she's a combination of herself and my feelings towards her. What do you mean? I'm just so angry at her and at my father. I think she's her, but she's also partly me. I'm not even sure I understand it myself. Yeah, that makes absolutely no sense. But just like everything else makes no sense in this insanity. damn what area. What you have that Mr. Fink would hurt the Lutesses? The Lutesses told me. The Lutesses? When? Yesterday. Yesterday morning. Rupert! They've been dead these seven days. Got it. Well, that's, that's a weird, um, whatever the heck that is. I say let's search real quick, just to be sure. Comstock seems to have been made sterile by simple exposure to our contraption. A theory, just as sexual reproduction can de-emphasize the traits of each parent, so goes the effect of multiple realities on our own. Your traits dissipate until they become unrecognizable or cease to exist. Okay, that that answers a few questions, but not everything. That's my mother. I assure you, madam, my sexual interest in your dear prophet is non-existent. And Madame Lutess. Furthermore, the man is quite sterile. That's a lie. You can't really see anything. They were my parents. And what were you to them? The child that they decided to imprison. Yeah, we well I found that out earlier. The twins send us to find three truths. Were, were the tears somehow related through a, a kind of quantum field, or were they Elizabeth? I wanted you to understand her. Who? You mean And then we got another Lady recording from her. Stock seems to believe the child is a result of some errant act of carnality between myself and her beloved prophet. I told the poor woman the truth, that the child was a product of our little contraption. But I think she found that less believable than her delusion. So the wife thought she they were cheating, but they made her as a science project. She's not even a person, apparently. Well... More audio logs for them. Comstock has sabotaged our contraption. Yet, we are not dead. A theory. We are scattered amongst the possibility space. But my brother and I are together. And so I'm content. He is not. The business with the girl lies unresolved. But perhaps there is one who can finish it in our stead. Is that me? Are you guys trusting me to do all that? I don't know if I'm willing to do all that. Everything looks so shiny. He killed Lady Comstock. And 
anyone who knew the truth was better dead than alive. I'm not even his daughter. I'm just some specimen to be poked. No, you are not. And we're gonna take him out for that. Ain't nobody in the world deserves that. That is so true. We are getting out of here. You got it? We're going we're to Paris! To Return to the Comstock gate. Well, here's our fingerprints. This is not my mother. Neither are you. I killed you both. This is me. Oh, you're you're having a whole conversation for this? Oh. Um. Another fight. Let's do this. Thank you for the health pack. I was about to die. When the heck did I switch that? Um, I'd never switched that. Ah, I'm dead. Never mind. I think I did it. Okay. We just fought a ghost and won. And now we're gonna actually go into Comstock's house. But I'll have to wait because that took out a lot from me. All that fighting, the ghosts and whatnot. And she had all her mental stuff that she just finished up with. So I'm gonna refill on ammo right now or whatever. And we'll continue this later. Or we'll go into Comstock's house in the next episode. So I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.